Now, the East African Community Regional Force aircraft has achieved full deployment status in line with the reposturing of troops as approved by the heads of state mini summit held in Addis Ababa on the 17th of February 2023. This was upon the recommendations of the East Africa Community Chiefs of Defense Forces, Chiefs of Defense Staff, with the extension of service expected to be ratified soon by the heads of state summit. And and the military mission inside the youngest member of the East Africa community will reconfigure its um, plans on how to move forward in ensuring the affected communities in the civil strife in that region are able to come home and uh, be in a peaceful environment. Now, Leila Mohammed reports. The arrival of South Sudanese contingent troops to Rumangabo forward operating base has been termed as a significant milestone in the last phase of deployment in the multinational sector of Rushuru and Masisi territories in the Eastern Democratic Republic of Congo, DRC. With the attainment of full deployment by ICRAF, the military component of the EAC multifaceted mission to foster peace in the Kiev regions is expected to enhance a sequenced and orderly withdrawal of M23 to the designated catonment areas. Residents of Niragongo and Rushuru territories have embraced collective efforts for peace and stability by military forces. Life is slowly coming back to a near normal as the people in the two regions are registered along the Goma, Kibumba, Rumangabo, Rushuru main supply route following its opening and restoration of security. The local community has engaged in a joint effort of repairing the affected road sections that are hazardous to motorists transporting people and goods leading to accidents along the RN2 main supply route. Leila Mohammed, NTV.